The cargo may be microscopic, but there are only two containment labs in the country with enough biosecurity to handle the Zika virus and experiments on mosquitoes to answer a question with serious health consequences. We just don't know if some of our species might be able to transmit it as well. The Aedes aegypti is mainly blamed for spreading the Zika virus in Latin America. It can't survive in cold climates. But we know from the literature that there are at least 20 other species that have tested positive for Zika in addition to Aedes aegypti. This species is what worries Hunter the most. A close cousin of Aedes aegypti, the Aedes albopictus is also known as the Asian tiger mosquito. Zika is just human Hunter says it can mosquito. carry the Zika virus and has been found intermittently in Canada, part of a disturbing new trend. We've seen uh, at least half a dozen species now in Ontario that weren't here previously. Scientists began monitoring mosquitoes more closely after the arrival of the West Nile virus. This entomologist says as the threat diminished, so did the lessons that were learned. When West Nile came in, there were very few people in the country who actually had the expertise to deal with it. And I would argue that at this point, we still have very few experts who can deal with it. And that's the unanswered question. If mosquitoes can indeed carry the virus, what next? Vicadopia, CBC News, St. Catharines, 